Hi guys. So we've been really, really busy out in the <clears throat> backyard doing some work. And I kind of wanted to get some housework done. So I'm taking a break from the backyard and I'm doing the housework. And I figured I may as well do kind of like a day in the life. It's not going to be a full day in the life. But I may as well just show you what I'm doing. Um, it is, let me look at time. It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Jackson's taking a nap. I think he laid down around um, 12.30. You can see my chairs are up. I'm getting ready to mop. And then behind me here is the toy room. That's next. Um, I want to organize the toys and clean them because with all the work we're doing, doing outside, I don't know if I can even show you through the window. It's really bright. Probably can't even see anything. Yeah, they're out working. Hubby's over there, my cousin's over there. Anyway, um, with all the work they've been doing, what well, we've been doing outside, it's getting really dusty in here. So I need to clean off all the toys and the appliances and the electronics and just clean, 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 and then get caught up on laundry. Um, I don't know if I mentioned on YouTube, I know I did on my Facebook, but uh, my cousin, her husband, and her three kids moved in with us temporarily. Um, they really relocated from out of state. So um, there's 10 people in the house, so got to keep up on the house stuff. Um, otherwise, it gets out of control really quickly. So anyway, that's what I am doing right now. And yeah, I'll catch up with you in a little while. Okay, it is probably about 2.30 right now. I, I took all the toys out of that bin. And um, what I do is I dump them in the middle of the floor because they get disorganized and everything. Oh, and out of that bin too. And then I can go through them um, about once a week, decide which ones are broken, which ones need to be cleaned, and then reorganize them all. And I find... I'll get it. And I just find it easier just to dump them all out there. And then as I go through them, I take some of the ones that can't just be soaked that I want to wash because, you know, they get dirt in them or whatever from playing outside. And um, I set them up here and make sure, and usually it fills up the whole table by the end. And then I'll wash them one by one by hand and then put them back. Um, that's kind of how the system works. So right now I'm just going to start organizing the toys, throwing out the broken ones, cleaning the ones that need to be cleaned, and yeah, that's what we're doing. And then I'm going to go through that bin right there as well. All right, bye. So it only took about 20 minutes. We got it all done, reorganized, didn't have to dump that much. Parker's cleaning the kitchen. <laughs> but those toys are all back in their spot from the table. So now it's laundry time, right? Oh, you better put the cars away. Was someone cooking cars? What? Was Jackson cooking cars, you think? Yeah. Are you going to help me with some laundry next? Yeah. Awesome. I have a good helper today. And then we got vacuum because now that we cleaned everything out, there's little crayon wrappers and everything all over the carpet. Okay, well, I got the laundry done. And while I was doing the laundry, the guys were out here. They got the topsoil in. They tilled it. Now we have to uh, go rent the trencher and we're going to run the water lines and then go pick up some grass seed and whatnot and get that in. I got to return the tiller there back to the Home Depot. We got stuff sitting up here now. But by the way, does anybody know how to clean those things? It's the umbrella for the table. It's disgusting and I tried cleaning it and it's not coming clean. So I'm not sure what to do with that. but. We got it from free for free from my father-in-law, but yep, yeah, it's got all the mulch mix and everything. So hopefully the grass takes really nicely. I'm so so excited. I'm guessing about two months before we can actually have a lawn. I'm guessing the grass will start sprouting after a month. I don't know. We'll see. But it's cold. I'm so excited. It's getting there. I feel good, the house is clean. Uh, Chris and my cousin went out to go get the trencher for the yard. So we got the kids up here playing. It's noisy. Um, and then when they get home, we're probably gonna do supper. I have no idea what time it is right now. I can go look. It is uh, 4.56. So everything's done and um, I'll just probably tidy up the toys again because I have an interview this afternoon. 
So until then, we're just gonna play and then we'll eat some. Yeah, that's what we're doing. After all the work today, we're gonna have burgers, brats, and hot dogs. So I got some stuff cut up. We're steaming stuff. It's about 6:30. Our buns are laid out. Our cheese. I'm just waiting on. <laughs> the guys are grilling on the rock, the new rock. But I'm hungry, and then I have an interview after that. So. Hey guys. So it is quarter after eight. No, quarter till eight. <laughs> Um, the big kids are laying downstairs watching a movie before bed, um, all the cousins, uh, there's four of them down here. The babies have been laid down, so hopefully they fall asleep good. <clears throat> um, my cousin's still out back running the trench room, my husband's running to Home Depot to get, um, pipe and stuff for the irrigation line, and then I think this mom deserves a drink tonight after everyone's asleep. <laughs> So that's kind of what I'm doing right now. Um, hopefully everybody stays asleep. And yeah, I'll catch up with you later. <clears throat> it is 8.30. Me and Lucky are going for a walk. He's been kind of cooped up in the house with all the yard work going on, so I thought we'd take him for a nice walk since all the other kids are asleep, I think, except for my oldest. <laughs> and come on. I'm lucky. And yeah, and then I'm gonna go back and I think they're putting the pipe in now for the watering system, so. Oh, it's so nice out tonight, finally a break from the heat. <laughs> anyway, I know you guys can't see me and you can only hear me, so I'll let you go and I'll catch you back in a little bit. All right, so it is quarter after 11 and we ran into a bump in the road. Our till, or not tiller, our trencher we rented stopped working <clears throat> so we're just gonna call it quits for the night and hopefully when we go back in the morning because um, we hand dug a lot lucky lucky we had to hand dig a lot so I'm hoping they'll either give us a large discounted price or I really don't think they should charge us at all because it didn't work um, and it's an expensive piece of equipment to be running especially when it's not working so, I'm going to go to bed. Um, Chris is still out there working a little bit, uh, but I have to get up early for work. My first kid, I think, comes at around 5.30, so, yeah, I'm off to bed, and we'll see how tomorrow goes out there, and I'm so excited to show you guys what it's going to look like when it's done, but that is my um, not-so-normal evening in the life tonight. It's not normally like that on the weekends, but since we're doing all the yard work and all that kind of stuff, it's just kind of how it's been going this weekend. So anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Hope you all had a good weekend. Bye.